Now, Tuesday's election is predicted to have a high voter turnout, but there are some things you need to know before you head to the polls. WVUA 23's Yasmin Panetta joins us live tonight from our newsroom with more. Yasmin. Jabari, here are some frequently asked questions and misunderstandings that voters need to know before Tuesday. When you turn in a voter registration application, that means you are all set to vote, right? Wrong. According to Alabama.gov, once your application has been processed by your local board of registrars, you should receive an acknowledgement from them indicating the status of your application, which usually comes in the form of a voter identification card. From there, polling locations are assigned based on the address you are registered under. If you change your address since you registered to vote, but have not updated it, you can vote where you are registered. You can then update your address. Voters can also send in an absentee ballot if they are unable to make it to the polls on Election Day. Even though Election Day has been one of the most anticipated days of the year, that does not mean you are able to take pictures or video while inside your polling place. WVUA 23's political analyst Steve Flowers says this election is one of a kind and the reason the turnout is so strong. I think the presidential race has been very exciting, the Trump factor, uh, the, all the media attention, nationwide media. Voters are encouraged to know where to go vote. Reporting live in the newsroom, Yasmin Pineda, WVUA 23 News.